Well, welcome back to another uh, episode of the Tide Riders, eh? This week, we've got a special guest. Uh, none other than... ta -da! <laughs> Guess who's back? <laughs> well, Harley has had some ligament damage in his knee, suspected broken finger, and an ingrown toenail. Bit of a warrior, but he's back until probably the end of February, then he's going for an operation on his torso. How long, you, how long are you expecting out for that one? What's your recovery time? Couple of weeks? Six weeks. Six weeks. Six weeks. Have you out? Reckon? Yeah. Just to pay my house in there. Bye. 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 Well, 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 we've got the rods out already. Um, we've opted for the Fireblade GTs this week with the Shimano um, Power Aero XS. C or B? XSC. XSC, 40,000. Um, we're hunting Rays, Rays, Conga. Um, we're on the southwest coast of Scotland this week with the lads and the lads are with us so they'll be popping in the camera too. So hopefully we're gonna have a bit of a ray fest. Absolutely, that's what we're after. I think Peter's right. just getting a bite there first cast, so hopefully he is because he's on my team. So and <laughs> good when the day. Me and Harley, Danny and Peter, and Paul and his son Tyler. So five other man will pay for the Chinese tonight. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll keep you talk about the rigs. Talk about obviously the fish we're going for, few bits and pieces. We've got some new rigs for we're doing the dongle over this week. Well, everybody's on it at the minute, so I've used dongle for he's been using it for year, years. Well, two years. So we're just gonna we're gonna have at it, and uh, we'll come back and forget any fish. Session first cast, beating the lads. Let's get them back. Right, the day walking for the dongle, a bit of fish gear. Um, nine times out of ten, the, the dongle's always um, caught in the side of the, the raised mouth. So that's my interpretation of the dongle. I'm using a 6 o octopus with a bit of wire from a lead weight and a bit of um, silicon tube in there. And then I've got my clip on the bottom which clips into the splashdown, like so. So that would be like that. So. We're going to just be using some mackerel and some squid. So I normally match the size of the, the wire that I'm using to the bait. And then I pierce the, the wire into the fish. Like so. Plenty of uh, thread. Then, so there's a nice, a nice cedar mackerel there, and then run a bit of squid on the other side, like so. And 
man. Put the hook into the squid like that. To the base like that. Also, any access, trim it off. So, not a huge bait. Um, they're just big enough for Thorny's mouth and have a lot of success with these. So, uh, <laughs> Paul's pulling the moon at us at the minute. <laughs> Right, we'll get this one out. Hey, there we go. I missed my first day. Uh, I wasn't watching, I missed the first bite. So, brought it in. Didn't even bother rebaiting it back up, just had a look at it, it was fine. Send it back out. And I got myself a nice seven pound 30 there. Just put on the scales. So, what we're going to do is we're going to get them all back. Uh, actually, we'll put them in this rock pool. There's a, I'm literally standing in a rock pool. Um, so, I. Not bad. I'd seen earlier than not made. Think that sort of thing. Oh, that's a nice. What the hell? Come on. Yeah. First cast, first fish. Um, the first bite I got, more like a flipping tote run. Um, to me, it was a small conga or something, picked my bait up and then I missed it, left it, and then I'm getting a bite off a, off a thorny. But I uh, just want to talk a little bit about the dongle. Now, I'm using uh, the, the 6 0 um, octopus um, from Sea Glow, Kentaro. See the hook there. Is right in the corner of its mouth. Now, obviously, there's the dongle that I use here, it's perfect. Right in the corner of its jaw. So, it's a nice female. Um, Peter's into his second one there by the look of it. Are you another one there, Peter? 
Oh yes. So there's there's fish there. Yeah. So there we go. Unhooked. Unharmed. A lovely looking creature. The thumbback ray. This one's been a little bit stubborn. Little thorns on it. Are you deleted some more, like Danny? Are you deleted some more than the thing? Eh? Huh? Yeah, in a second, so just watching there. That's the first one of the session for me. Um, had a little bit of a nightmare at the beginning. There's a ski runs out to the right of us, and um, I was getting caught up on there a couple of times. It's just shy of eight pound. Caught on multiple sea glue opponents, components, should I say? Um, yeah, hopefully plenty more to come.
fishing slowed down at the minute. Absolutely. Um, it's been absolutely nothing for the past couple of hours. Like, had a load of rays last to the flood, but the ebb, it's been, it's been quite. Well, the plan. Yeah, predominantly it's a flood. Uh, yeah, it's just off the way it's big today. I mean, it, it is quite big tides for as well, isn't it? Massive tides, massive tides. Uh, so we're going to have another hour here. Yeah. Um, it's nice to see God take it, wasn't it? Ah, absolutely. Oh. Absolutely. I was not expecting that. No, no I was we, expecting a conga. Like, yeah. Back over on, in the northeast now, it, it's literally biblical and, the, and everybody will be fishing for the cod. So we come over this way to get away from the cod and young Holly Bags one. So. <laughs> <laughs> um, today's been nice though. I mean, the sun has been out, there's been no rain, there's a slight breeze in the air. Um, it's been a nice day. That's, Lovely. Not loads of fish, but there's been fish. Uh, so, so we'll get back here, see if we have anything else. Definitely, definitely. The most fish? Yeah. Hey, <laughs> Which team won there? Can we just clarify? Bad teams here. Um, we should have maybe said at the start uh, Danny and Peter, me and Harley and Paul and uh, Tyler. But uh, they kept lost like they had quite a few rays. What was it? Uh, five pound a man? <laughs> Three Chinese on these guys, the mates. It was the um, father and son competition. Um, so this is me adopted son. Peter, reports tonight, Peter is going to be my adopted son because clearly it's a way forward. <laughs> Not the blood in the Taylor. <laughs> Taylor. So this is part one. Part two, we're going to be fishing tonight. So stay tuned, folks. Plenty more to come. <laughs> In the corner of its mouth there. <laughs> <laughs>